All right, folks, today we're making this amazing looking foldable club sandwiches. So stay tuned. It's time to grill. The New York club sandwich is really an amazing invention from the American sandwich culture. Let's get started with seasoning some chicken breasts. We are using a spicy barbecue rub today to get some heat into that sandwich. Make sure to season from both sides and let that rest for one hour. In the meantime, take some mayo, Dijon mustard, salt, pepper, barbecue rub and give it a good mix. I have already preheated my Swiss gas grill the Outdoor Chef Dual Chef 160 degrees Celsius 320 degrees Fahrenheit indirect heat for 45 minutes. Now crisp up some bacon. I'm using my infrared cooking zone with my hex clad pan and I just keep going adding bacon stripes take them out until they are almost done and crispy and I kept them warm and gave them the final color on indirect heat beside the chicken on my gas grill. After 45 minutes your chicken should read an internal temperature which is safe from salmonella. Take it out, let it rest, take two eggs in a bowl, give it a whisk. Usually those club sandwiches are served with fried eggs. I'm not into fried eggs today, we are using the omelette technique for the sandwich which makes it foldable but I'll show you this later. Slice the chicken breast after a short rest. And only two more ingredients needed. You will need some fresh lettuce. I won't show you that before the preparation of the sandwich. And tomatoes. Slice tomatoes. And then take again the hex clad pan or your favorite pan, which is non stickable. Add some butter lard in the middle. And start with the egg. I saw this hack about making egg sandwiches a lot on my social media pages so I decided to adapt this to the club sandwich. Take two slices of bread and as soon as the egg starts to get a little bit harder flip it and add your sandwich ingredients. Start with the sauce, lettuce, tomatoes, chicken, bacon and that's it. At that moment I realized sometimes less is more because you will lose a lot of that stuffing if you do it the uh, way I do it with the first sandwich. You could also fold the egg into the sandwich later. I'll show you with my second sandwich. You should be on low heat now and just crisp up the bread. You could keep this warm on low heat on your gas grill and keep going with the other sandwiches. You will get better sandwich by sandwich about timing and flipping and the color of the bread later on. Now flip it, fold the eggs to the middle of the sandwich, looks a little bit better and now again add your sandwich ingredients, sauce and of course as always you will find a whole list of ingredients and measurements inside the video description. So make sure to check it out if you want to recreate this foldable club sandwich at home. It's easy and it looks really impressive. Tomatoes, chicken breast, bacon of course and the combination is really amazing. I love it. It's so delicious. So again crisp up. After two more minutes the other side after two or three more minutes take it out and serve. Those look amazing. They are so juicy and as I mentioned the combination of flavors is really good. And of course as always I'm gonna give this a shot right now. Can't wait to hear your thoughts about the foldable club sandwich and your ideas Make sure to subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. I would really appreciate if you could help me grow the 0815 Barbecue International channel a little bit more. Anyway, <laughs> I like it. 
Thanks for watching. I'm out. See you.